Brad, you have been an addict to crack. How do you think about hard drugs today? Well, I uh, I don't do it anymore. I think um, I think crack is probably the the worst poison that has ever been introduced uh, to to uh, to human beings. I mean, uh, I think it personally, I think it's worse than heroin because I I experimented with heroin uh, quite a bit and um, alcohol and um, although I guess it depends on the individual I will say that I'm not I don't want it to sound that I, like I'm anti-drug because I'm not anti-drug I happen to be a drug addict and when I take a drug I can't stop I, and I th and um, or if I have a drink I continue drinking until I black out so I had to stop uh, but um, I think that uh, part of that has to do with my uh, perhaps my environment but I think a, a great deal of it has to do with um, genetic physical causes I think the central nervous system of a of a drug addict and an alcoholic is different from the central nervous system of a non drug addict alcoholic and in fact uh, medical studies have been done they've done research on the spinal cord of um, drug addicts and alcoholics and they find um, genetic differences between them so that there is some kind of inherited trait and um, so what I think is if you can handle it and you can use it drugs can be good they can be good to relax the atmosphere at a party LSD can be very good to expand your mind you know I, I love LSD I just don't I just and I don't think LSD is an addictive drug personally but I had, I had tried to stop taking crack in the past and I tried to stop drinking in the past and I say, okay, I'll, I won't drink, I'll just smoke pot or I won't uh, take crack, I'll just drink and <laughs> whatever, th it, the one thing that I decided I would do, I did so much of it to compensate for not doing anything else uh, because that's how I was, that I had to stop everything, you know. But I, I think that there are people who can handle it and I think that for the people who can handle it, it's, it's okay. I don't think there's anything wrong with it. I just think that um, when it comes to the point where the uh, the pain of, of using the things are too great, then the pain of not using them, then you have to stop.